Positive Psychology, an interview conducted by Lucas Borganio in conjunction with Wright State University featuring Dr. Tamara Schneider. Welcome, Dr. Schneider, to this interview that we're going to share together about positive psychology. Positive psychology's place in psychology. What is the place of positive psychology regarding the entire field of psychology? So positive psychology um, has a place in the broader domain of psychology, um, partly because it has helped to redraw our attention onto the human strengths mm -hmm. that we possess and um, how those human strengths can help us to um, have more fulfilling lives. And so that sounds perhaps like this focus on having positive attitudes. Mm -hmm. Um, but it really can also be a focus on knowing what our own inherent strengths are uh, as people. Um, we may be good at some things and not, well, we are good at some things and we're not so good at other things. And um, there are different cultures that have a different focus on building strengths versus making, trying to make the whole individual good and building up weaknesses perhaps in an individual. And by by knowing what human strengths might be and by knowing what your own personal human strengths are, if you can build on your strengths, you can be unique in that domain of what strengths that, that, strengths that you have. And by having this domain of positive psychology, we can get a better understanding of what are the good things that people might possess and, and how do we know that they're good. And that's really where the systematic research is required. So again, going back to the idea about winning the lottery, a lay person would think, oh, if I just won the lottery, my life would be great, I would be happy. And now we know because of research, good research, that no, that's actually not the case. Um, so maybe instead of focusing on um, monetary gain, up to a certain level, I mean, if you have a certain level of resources, you're gonna be just as happy as if you had an extreme level of resources. And so then what should you focus on? Mm -hmm. so focusing on relationships, um, for example, is one thing that really helps people have grounding. Social support can be a buffer for stress. We wouldn't know those um, answers if positive psychology wasn't a domain in the broader field of psychology. And it's beyond some of the other fields of psychology um, health psychology, which focuses on um, mind-body interactions, physical health, and what psychology can bring to the mind-body interactions. Um, cognitive psychology, which focuses on uh, how we go about thinking and, mm -hmm. and how we can improve thinking. And uh, there are so many different domains of psychology, and positive psychology absolutely has, has a place in helping us to understand the vast array of um, things that humans do that are great and that could make us even better.